Well, we're on Pickering Wharf, just a few steps from the waterfront, where we found this really cool shop. It's called Joe's Fresh Fish Prints and Tomo's Tackle. Yeah, so it's a tackle shop, and it's also an art gallery mm -hmm. and a place where Joe Higgins, the proprietor, actually prints fresh fish. That's right. You can actually bring a fish in. He'll make a print of it, and it, uh, you can suitable for framing, and then you can eat the fish. Yeah, and it's a Japanese art form, and it's gorgeous, and I think we're going to be able to go inside and I, have him. I think he's got a fish in there for us. To print. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's see. Hey, Joe. What kind of fish do you have to print? Well, I tried to get a straight bass for you, but uh, I have some friends out there and they weren't able to get me one. So what I have here... A burgle. A burgle. <laughs> hey, I think that one stole my bait one time. <laughs> Generally, the fish is cold, so it gives me about a two or three hour window mm -hmm. if it's a striped bass or an edible fish. So it gets printed and then eaten. Yep, you can have your fish, you can eat it too. <laughs> you can put it on your wall and it can look down on you. As, you, as you're eating as you're it. Eating. Mm, that's kind of creepy. <laughs> well, let's, uh, let's print this burgle. There isn't really any rules as far as Giyotaku, which is the, the Japanese official, yes. official name for the process. Mm -hmm. Giyotaku. I just say fish prints. <laughs> so you just have fun with it, right? I mean, the thing is, anyone can do this. I've had eight-year-old kids come in here and I go, wow, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right now, I've got all the ink on. I noticed that you did not paint over the eye. Well, I'll go in after the prints made and paint it in. Right? Oh, yeah. So I'm basically just going to lay the paper. And I'll start on the front. I'll work my way down the fish. And then I'll find the eye. The process is uh, really just getting all the important details. The paper is thin enough that you can see what's happening mm -hmm. through the paper. I pull it back, and, and there's a, cool. a nice, simple nice. little fish print. So let's uh, have you guys. Try. All right. That sounds good. You're up, Parker. I can't say I've ever done this. Well, there you go. A little fish massage. How about like a little bit on the head? I think that's good. Okay. Yeah, yeah Tom, stay off. This is my art. I can still hope I print out really far so it looks like yeah. a bigger fish. <laughs> All right, Tom's <laughs> right, turn. All right, we're going to mix it up. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What, you know, I have a little yellow and okay. a little blue. All right, good. Well, I'm going to just go crazy on this, uh, this burgle. All right, I think I'm ready to go. I think I'm ready to print. This is it. This is intense. His hands are shaking a little bit, which could disturb the... Uh, <laughs> Huh? Nice. Huh? Very Am I nice. good or what? Uh, huh? Since uh, the fish print is a Japanese art form, we have a, the official representative from Japan <laughs> to, uh, to be the judge. Yeah. This is Tomo. Well, I think I'm going to go with Parker. Oh, 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 man! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Here's that 20. <laughs> <laughs> so a really unique place right here in Pickering Wharf. A really great guy. And some beautiful prints. That's right. No, no one walks away empty-handed. Joe's Fresh Fish Prints. Say that five and times fast. And Tomo's Tackle. And Tomo's Tackle. Say that five times fast. Come and see him on Pickering Wharf.